ladies and gents, we continue our coverage of the 2024 Lama Show. And with this event, as you can imagine, there are all manner of machines and all manner of sizes of machines. Now, we are now on the Jay Riley stand, who you could safely say is at the upper end of the scale when it comes to size of machines. So I'm now joined by Managing Director, Mr. Matt Cars, who's going to talk us through the quad yeah. 550. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. Not sure if Chris is going to get it all on yeah, camera, yeah, yeah, yeah. but we'll do what we can. So, Matt, yes. give us a tour of the Quad 550, yeah. front to back, yeah. round we go. So, Quad 550, as it mentions, 550 horsepower, Volvo Penta engine, um, class cab, touchscreen by Vavat, GPS screen, John Deere, Trimble, whatever you like. So any guidance system yeah, you can fit any, on this? any guidance. Yeah. And then also prepared for the John Deere NIR nutrient analysis. Okay, so just on yeah. it, you can yeah. pop that in there. Yeah. So that's suited for the John Deere, John uh, Deere, John Deere yeah. sensor, yeah. is it? Yeah. Could you put other sensors in there as well? We can. There's as a, well? another one that works with Trimble, um, but most popular in the UK is the, the John Deere Yeah, because so. that, well, that works with quite a few things. Yeah, you know, put it on the back of the forager spout exactly. and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah. So this guy, this machine is sold up to a, a, a customer up in Ormskirk, Ferns Farm Partnership, Rob Rennell. Right. Um, so that will be... Near us, then. Yeah, that's up, up near your corner. So that's coming up near us? <laughs> yeah, next, right. next week. Yeah. Next so week. we'll... Uh, yeah, might so see. it's not going to stay this clean for that no, long? this is the cleanest right. you'll ever see it. Cool. <laughs> so, so we're going to have to catch up with him once yeah, he's got a few hours under his belt. Yeah. We'll have to see this. Yeah, so... Right. so Sorry, carry class, on. Class cab, GPS, NIR sensor, and then we've got a Vogel Sang. A Vogel Sang rotary lobe pump, so that's 12,000 litres a minute um, rotary lobe, so yeah. 12,000 litres a minute, 10 inch suction arm. Yeah, that's your main filling pump, that yeah. right there. Filling and um, spreading pump, yeah. Right, so that's doing two jobs, so, yeah, that. Yeah, right. so that will fill, Got you. fill the 22 cube tank in about two and a half minutes. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> so, so in that case, obviously you're going to want to keep this in the field and keep yeah, this working yeah, yeah, like you would yeah. with a big self propelled yeah. sprayer. And you're going to have to have some big tankers. Big tankers. Keeping up yeah, with this. Big tankers. So a lot of customers will be two or three axle tankers, 22 cube, or the next next step is the Arctic tankers, lorry, yeah. lorry tankers that we, we can now supply from a German manufacturer as well. Right. So, yeah. so you got it all. So yeah, filling yeah. on then. Yeah. Filling arm, so this is in its uh, road road mode, so it's docked out of the way. Yeah. So machine is three meters wide, suction arms docked. Oh, she's out. compact. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> and then in the field, you can either dock it out out of sight, or you can have it out the front, um, just down here. So that's a drip tray. Any excess will drop right. drop drop down. And so then in terms of filling options, then you could be pretty much anywhere. Yeah. You could have it around the front yeah, to exactly. the side. Yeah. Because often in the field, this will be opened up, you know, yeah. with its beams out, so it's easy to nose it, it into exactly, something. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Um, op optional, you can have a 700 mil telescopic suction arm just to, know, bit, just, uh, to just even more. Bit yeah. more over the yeah. edge. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. yeah. That's it. Um, what else have we got here? It's higher inflation system. Yeah. So that's an option. Uh, most common in the UK, we've got 960, 42, so the biggest tyres. We've possible, got the big really. Mitchies on this one. Mitchell and Serex bib. So. Yeah. Cube. And have you got all the sizes in, in this range? Or is... So quad is 22 cube, then we do the trike three-wheeler machine, yeah. which is a 16 cube, and then we do a trike five-wheel machine, which is a 20 cube. And then what have we got here? And so what we've got yeah. in, in here? Cool it, yeah, another bolt. Um, AdBlue, fuel tank, hydraulic cooling, and then axle cooling as well. Right, that's for the axle cooling, yeah. that, right? Yeah. You say they're uh, doing a bit of work, yeah, aren't they? Exactly, yeah, exactly, yeah. And what's transmission on this? Oh, yeah, OMSI axles, yeah. and then two uh, two Bosch Rexroth gear. Right, so she's all hydrostatic. Well, uh, uh, like a hydromechanical. Oh, hydromechanical, yeah. right. Yeah. Oops. Shut that, not break it, try not to. So I'm moving around the back then. Yeah, uh, so, and then sort of standard three point or four point linkage. Um, this has got a 24 meter Vogel Sang dribble bar on. Yeah. Um, we can do we can do attachments from a, a six meter disc cultivator up to a 30 or 36 meter. Yeah. You know, and when you've bar. got, wait, say if you're using an attachment behind it, discs or tines or whatever, yeah. and you're applying slowly at the same time, can you crab steer with this as yeah, well? Yeah, yeah, crab yeah. steer. Yeah, yeah, right. exactly. So. 
spot on. And presumably this extension that we're seeing here that, is for that is purely for to the accommodate for, these for, booms. for the Vogelsang boom. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And the, we've got uh, what have we got? Three 30 meter booms out now. A couple of 24s. We've got yeah. a couple of 20. Uh, couple of 36 meters as well um pushing so, it yeah we're um, and are, are we entering into the realms of sprayer technology in terms of variable application yeah, section so, control so that is that possible sort of we, we can upload spread spread maps yeah. we can also uh download spread maps so you know the nutrient analysis system you can apply per nutrient value rather than total cubes yeah right oh. Cool, and then this this big boom then, presumably this will have multiple uh, well, 24, macerators on yeah, there. Yeah, there's a couple couple on each side, I believe, yeah. And then, um, so we can offer Vogelsang dribble bars, Bomec trailing shoes, you know, the, 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 which, whichever the customer yeah. requires. Really. And machines like this, presumably it'd be quite customised and bespoke to the customer. Yeah, exactly, like, you know, <laughs> Main thing is the machine, and then the, ne the next thing is what 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 they need to spread, and what tram line width, what section control. Yeah. You know, we can offer full full automatic section shut off as well from from the right. GPS. So. And cool. then what have we got here? We got the, down the main uh, the main heart is the Volvo engine, and then serviceability is uh, is is the best on, on, on the market in my opinion all, all the filters <laughs> literally you put it all yeah, down this all side the filters are in one row yeah. hydraulic tank the only filter isn't is uh, your air cleaner which is up there yeah but i know on other machines you have to tip the tank you have to tip the cab just to get to the actual filters so. yeah but you've put all this here all in one line yeah in terms of you know you got your engine down this side yeah and obviously you're gonna have other things down the other side is she a balanced machine left yeah. to right yeah left to right yeah. is balanced yeah right yeah and tank presumably that'll be baffled as well it, it is yeah you got four <laughs> baffle plates yeah yeah, yeah. you yeah. don't want to get a rocket yeah, and roll with this do you exactly yeah no oh. we've got um automatic uh hillside compensation on the front axle as well Right, so she'll jack she'll, it up, jack, jack it a corner up. When, when need be, yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah. Cool. And is that something you can adjust on the road as well, just stiffening up? Or? You can do manually, yeah. You can, yeah. Right? Yeah, it's just if if this is open as well, we've got a secret door. Ooh. Hello. Yeah, wash your hands, toolbox, yeah. automatic greaser, um, cooling fan, which is automatically reversible, so if your yeah. trash is coming in, that will automatically blow it out. Um, stone trap as well so the slurry will flow through there and, and stone trap you can just hydraulically open that and uh, it will dump it dump it all out cool so yeah she's a fair old machine yeah yeah cool stuff and then i believe if we sort of slide back around yeah. here we'll be yeah. able to see it's uh, written on the side of a machine yes. that it's a bit of an anniversary for jay Riley it is, this yeah. year yeah yeah so um yeah, with 30 years, uh, 30 years trading. Right. Jeremy Riley formed the company. 30 years, and we've been working with Avat Machinery for, for for literally 30 years, starting with beet harvesters. Obviously, slurry machinery yeah. as the market's grown, it's uh, yeah. it's becoming more popular. But yeah, it's um, not, that's not a very it's fair old partnership, really, it is, isn't it? Yeah, not not many not many brands and and dealers and importers work together for that that period of time. No, well, that's it, and that must. You know, that's a, that's a lot of trust by yeah. Vervier yeah, yeah. to put in Jay Riley, yeah. but they obviously trust Jay Riley because they know the market in the exactly, UK. Exactly, yeah. And, yeah. you know, we're very, you know, customer-focused, service is key for us, and uh, if, if the customer's happy and he's, he's looked after, they're coming back, hopefully. So, yeah. That's it. And really, machines this size, you want them coming back, exactly, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Spot on, Matt. Thank you very much yeah. for that. That's good to Love see Love that. <laughs>